killed the most people, right? Most decorated sniper, right? He's in Iraq, killing Iraqis. And how did he call them? He said in the movie, they're savages. See? See, when they deprive you of your humanity and call you a savage, that's to justify killing you. Who were the Native Americans? They were savages. Then wipe them out. is under attack. Hollywood is preparing the way. So you hear the Adan. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Oh, see, when you hear that, you get terrified. Oh, God, it's them Muslims. Is my sister Nadira here? Where's Nadira? Can I see you up here for a minute, please? Open that for her. Now, you don't know my sister, but let me tell you something about her. They killed 21 Coptic Christians in Egypt the other day. Right? You think that we kill Christians? Wait now, it's happening. We love our Christian family. That's our mama, our daddy, our sister, our brother, our auntie, our uncle, our cousin, our classmates, our teammates. That Prophet Muhammad never killed Christians just because they were Christians? He never killed Jews because they were Jews? These people are sick. But they have a role to play. Here's my sister. I watched her grow up in Islam. She's a school teacher. And while she was teaching school, there was a young girl in her class that was on dialysis. And Sister Nadira said to that student, I will give you one of my kidneys. Listen.
And at the church that the mother of that sister went to, they honored her. They respect this Muslim. So what I would like to see done, really, I would like to see a big story in the final call on internet everywhere about what our sister has done. you to get a picture of the sister that she gave the kidney to. And I want the biggest story that you could develop over this unselfish act. And I'm not lying, brother and sister. I don't know if I could give you my kidney. I'll give you my life, because I think that's sufficient. <laughs> but I, I got to hold on to my little kidneys. As... But my sister did this. And look, I don't know how many Muslims knew this. But it seemed like to me, we ought to make over an act like this. Seems like to me that in the face of Muslims killing Christians and Christians killing Muslims, we ought to show the love that Prophet Muhammad and the Honorable Elijah Muhammad has for their people. So my sister, uh, I don't know what to say or do to say thank you for the marvelous example. You know, she's a little nervous. She don't want to talk, you know, but I would gladly sit down just to hear a word from such a noble black woman. So we applaud her and uh, Brother Ashad will interview her, she'll talk to you. And some beautiful brother like you, of course she's married, she has a beautiful son, very happy, but she will talk to you. And I want to see her story everywhere. Everywhere.